It was like a jungle. The boy and girl gazed in awe as a string of puppets all in shapes and sizes, clowns, pirates, fairies, kings, cowboys, Indians, witches, reptiles, and in every type of animal. Oh, come on along quickly, the conductor said. We don't want to get all dilly dally on this car. He took it. He took we don't want the girl by the hand dis disappeared behind the maze of strings. The boy tried following fall them, but he had lost sight of them. He continued his path on the creepy a pu puppets, pushing their strings, but they were cobwebs. Most of the marionettes were smiles, but they seemed forced if their dolls were in pain. He passed the knight of armor, which is tangled up with the ballerina, with a curvy knight club, who, a singer whose feather and bow has been tied around the spiked heels. Finally, the boy spotted a conductor with the girl with the rear, rear door. The conductor was a was rattling his keys. I can't ever find this one, he muttered. The conductor and the girl didn't notice that the boy on their backs were on to them. The boy on to the another step and a hand was on the boy's shoulder with a thump and it galled at his hand with the long, sharp fingernails. The boy spun around and found themselves with him face to face with the marionette that is recognized as Average Scrooge and the old man from A Christmas Carol. Jumping back, the boys instantly became entangled in the nightclub singer's streams. He was ca caught fast. Completely unnerved, the boy struggled helplessly against the strings. Ah, here you are, said a familiar voice. The conductor, who was finding the right key, unlocked the door and pushed it open. A large gust of wind blew to open the marionettes and swirled all bounce around. Finally, with a, a thousand efforts, the boy pulled himself free. He dashed. Uh, to the conductor and the girl, and he, the three quickly escaped the car, slamming the door shut behind them.